Hello everyone, Mike Curtis with Sweet Cars, and today I'm gonna to give you some great detailing tips on how to use paint clay and some other things you probably didn't know about this all important detailing tool. So let's talk about what paint clay does. Well, what it does do is it removes the contaminants that are on the surface of your paint. Now there are some misconceptions about this because people often think that it removes swirls or that it's waxing car just because it leaves a really slick finish. The reason that it feels slick is because you are removing those harmful contaminants that are laying on the surface of the paint. So let's show you how to use paint clay. Now to do this, you'll need some very simple tools. Paint clay, of course. Uh, in this case, we're using Griot's Garage Paint Clay and then quick detailer spray. So this is from Sonics. This is their brilliant shine detailer and some microfiber towels. Okay, to wipe down the detail spray and a freshly clean car. You can't do that on a dirty car. It has to be uh, recently washed and out of direct sunlight. So really cool, uh, dry surface in which to work on, okay? Um, getting your paint clay, it's really simple. Just get enough of a piece that you um, can manage and basically flatten that down a little bit. Kind of like you're making a, a, about the size of a little cookie or something like that, okay? And then the next thing is your quick detail spray. The detailer spray basically works by adding lubricity to the surface in order to move this paint clay. And so when we do this down is you're basically just applying light pressure. And it's really easy to go uh, forward and back this way, um, going in circles. You, the, the car doesn't recognize that. So going forward and back this way and you'll hear and you'll feel in the clay the contaminants being lifted off that surface. And that's where you're leaving a really clean paint, okay? Bug tar, um, road debris, um, bugs, really easy to remove with paint clay. And you can always see the surface by, you know, how dirty it is by looking at your paint clay, okay? And then simply just wipe this down, okay? Now, one of the things that people often uh, get discouraged when they're using paint clay is as they're spraying this, if you don't spray enough detail spray and they tend to kind of get a little adventurous and venture out away from that surface, then you get this happening and you'll get paint clay that basically sticks to this, okay? If that happens to you, let's say you venture just a little too far of your reach, spray that again and the paint clay will remove uh, that from the surface, okay? Now, there's a lot of misconceptions. People, again, always think that this will remove swirls and things of that nature. It, it will not do that. Um, and let's say you have epoxy or something that's really strong on here. Um, you may want to use something else to clean it. Paint clay uh, does have its limitations, of course. So um, you're just cleaning things that are on the surface and you're skimming those things off. If you drop this paint clay, let's say you drop a piece of this on the floor when you're working and it comes off and it gets on there, then simply just pick off the pieces, you know, rocks and pieces of that, and then constantly then take your, your clay, and I'll show you with this one, is what you do is just basically shape it back into itself, fold it back in, start all over, and now you got a fresh piece of clay. So really simple to do, and once that's done, you're ready for your wax process or any other part of the paint correction process. Well, hopefully this answers some questions you might have in regards to using paint clay. It's a really simple tool to use. And here's an extra tip. When you're done using it, simply get a jar that's airtight, spray detailer spray in there, and basically it keeps it moist and ready for the next use. And as always, start at the top of the vehicle and do the dirtiest surfaces at the very end. And keep in mind, you can also use it for glass surfaces and for wheels. So until next time, take pride in your detailed ride.